looking at a maiten tree, a maitenus borea, that has a considerable amount of dieback. It's internal dieback, but it's throughout the whole tree. They have three matins on the property here, and they're all infected with something. I'm not quite sure what it is, so I took a few cuts out of the tree, and this was what we're looking at. You can see some of it is completely brown, some of it is drying out, and when you look closely at the wood, you can see that there's some discoloration there. There's a little bit of healthier tissue there, which relates to the greener section, but it's drying out. So I went further on, on the same piece, and I cut it back, here's where I cut that section off on. And I took my pen knife and I shaved away, and it, it looks like um, some kind of a trunk canker or internal canker disease. I did notice these little black holes here. I thought that maybe it was insect related, but I kind of dug them out and it doesn't appear to be any kind of a gallery or anything of that sort. There seems to be another one over here. Um, possibly, sometimes you'll see a tree that's got uh, big, big holes, more like a target canker. And I've never seen anything quite like this on a maiten tree. So when you look at the rest of the foliage, some of it's very green and some of it is bits that are starting to dry out. Um, this is all on the same same piece and you can see that there's some bits that are, are totally dried out. I'm a little stumped on this one. I'm not quite sure what it is, so if anybody can help me on this, I would sure appreciate it. The church here really treasures these trees. It's a very special area for them and they want to know what to do about it. And I hate to come back and say, I don't know, but I don't, I don't know.